uh, hello so somebody asked me for my skincare routine which is super flattering since my skin used to look horrible so just to get to the point i should not waste anybody's time this routine is really for people with acne prone skin so if you have clear skin it might not be that helpful for you and this routine might work for me more just because i have gone on accutane not just once but twice so if you haven't gone on accutane i still highly recommend it it might be a permanent fix for you but for me for some reason it only lasts for two and a half years before i relapse so this is my post Accutane skincare routine and I use topical tretinoin now and it keeps my skin mostly clear I still have a few marks here or there, but this is nothing compared to what my skin used to look like So if this helps anybody out then that makes me happy. Like I said, I wasted no time So I start out using Cetaphil extra gentle daily scrub I only use this at night and I didn't have a good angle to wash my face in the sink, so I do know I did rinse my face with warm water. And then I applied the scrub and I rub it in for maybe 45 seconds. I pat my face dry with a towel that I only use for my face. And the first product I apply is a serum. It is called Neutrogena Hydra Boost with Hyaluronic Acid. I apply two drops to the forehead, two drops to each cheek. And this shit goes on like water. It is like a glaze that just moisturizes your whole face. And know that I try to keep my routine as simple as possible. I don't be wanting to spend a lot of time in a bathroom and money on products, but the tretinoin is so drying that I have to layer up. If I had showered, hold up, please don't mind the way I hold things for the camera. I try to use my thumb and pinky to hold things to keep my other fingers clean. Anyways, this is when I would apply Neutrogena Hydra Boost Gel Cream Extra Dry to my chest. It keeps my skin protected from the tretinoin because it has gotten irritated in the past. Speaking of protection, I use this La Roche-Posay Telechion Double Repair Face Moisturizer on my eyelids only. I use it as an occlusive before applying tretinoin to prevent tret from being absorbed from my eyelids. I learned the hard way that my eyelids cannot handle tretinoin through weeks of red, swollen, and irritated eyelids. The only downside to this moisturizer is that it does tend to pill and crease, and so I only use it at night. Next, I apply the tretinoin. It's a cream at 0.025% strength. You do need a prescription for this, and this shit is no joke. You saw my eyes. You only need a pea-sized amount. And while I now use this every night or every other night, when you first start using it, you gotta start with once a week, and then twice a week, and then three times a week, or else your skin will fucking hate you. I dot it all around my face, avoiding super close to my eyes, and this tretinoin does not rub in well. So I apply this thick-ass Cetaphil moisturizing cream to rub it in. It it's not really a measured amount, it just depends on how dry my skin is feeling. And that concludes my night routine. My morning routine is not very different, so quickly, I rinse my face with warm water. I use Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser instead of the scrub, still washing for about 45 seconds. I rinse with cool water and pat dry with a face towel. I use the same serum that I used at night. I did shower before this, so I applied the Neutrogena Moisturizer to my neck and chest. If you plan on wearing eyeshadow, I recommend the thick Cetaphil Moisturizer on your eyelids. I use the same moisturizer on my cheeks and forehead but a little lighter this time because I know I'm also applying sunscreen. This is Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel Lotion. You should apply it liberally because tretinoin makes you more sensitive to sunburn. It says it's non-greasy, but bitch is greasy. I just put up with it because it doesn't break me out. And that concludes my post-Accutane skincare routine.